Thank you, matey. They took everything but my torch. I think I'm hiding it in my bum hole. That's that little shit. That little shit with a stupid hat. I mean, who wears a hat like that? Who wears a hat like that, guys? Ah! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! I think he just bit my dick. You little jerk. Get your hair cut. You look like a Lego man. And the bush is straight ahead. Where? Let me smash these ones. Oh, oh god! Oh, oh my god, help! I I just had, as I as I often do, just before a stream, like a last minute poo. A last minute poo, and I nearly, nearly had a push through. You're gonna see a hobbit suicide live on air. Are you saying you're gonna try and sexually assault a rhino? Oh. Um, fuck is that? Um. Um. Just run. Just run. Just run! it in your hand and tug it downwards. <laughs> We're having a wank. We're having a wank in this book. Ahoy, ahoy. We're having a wank. We're having a wank. Hello, Vicky. Thank you very much. Look at this. Subscriber for 10 months. What good egg you are. And hello, hi me. Hype, 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 hype. Is that how it goes? Maybe the arms are more, more like a Y, I guess, like this. But they look really small in the picture. Maybe it's, is it like this? I don't know. Hello, friends. How are you? I hope you're doing really well. Hope you've been having a lovely, lovely day. It's very warm. It's very warm where I am. I, I don't know what it is in your part of the world. Uh, but we busted out the air conditioning today. We've had it on in Mini Rusty's room before bedtime. We'll have it on in our room before bedtime. It's so hot. I'm not even wearing, not even wearing the hat. You like the thick beard? It is coming back. It is coming back. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm happy you like it. I'm happy it's coming back too. I think uh, if we do another charity stream next year, because they do get harder every year, uh, maybe we won't make it a, a goal to shave the beard off. Or maybe we'll make it one that's unachievable, like £10,000 or something. <laughs> Which we haven't done in all the seven years combined. So, yeah, I like I like the beard coming back. Not so much when it's when it's hot weather. But anyway, like I say, we're not wearing the hat today. Because um, it'll be too hot. But hey, today, look at this. We're gonna we're gonna have a bit of a go at this. I got this m as many of my games I come across in this way. Uh, it was in a sale on my Switch. I paid less than three pounds for it. I think the Suicide of Rachel Foster, um, and it's not a scary game per se, um, but it does build up 
uh, suspense and atmosphere as we go, which I think sometimes can be a bit more unnerving. Trigger warning, though. Trigger warning, guys. Um, it does deal with with some some pretty heavy shit from the from the looks of it, um, like child sexual abuse and suicide. Obviously, that's in the title. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. It might be it might be a bit of an experience for us. So I don't really know anything else about it other than other than that, and it, that it was cheap. So here we are. Here we are. Cheap old Rusty with his cheap old game. Um, and off we go. New game. New game. We got the drink. We got a straw. We'll be careful. We don't want to get it up our nose like we did last time. My dear Nicole. You're the daughter every mother dreams of. Beautiful, smart, and fair. We've been through a lot, and I know things haven't always been easy. But remember what Dr. Franklin said after your speech at high school graduation. What did he say? Oh look, hang on, the letter and the little subtitles at the bottom are different. Hang on, faced with the dragon, one must brandish sword and shield. Sometimes one has to know when to kneel before the dragon. Would you, was that part of her speech, do you think? I've always thought of you as a fighter who, faced with the toughest challenges, is capable of brandishing all the weapons necessary to fight courageously and heroically. We never talked about what happened with your father, aka Leonard. But now I need to tell you a few things before his illness, before this illness separates us. Ooh. So my mum is sick, and I'm Nicole. I am Nicole, am I? Oh, look, this is me, Umbrella Cam. All right, hang on. I didn't realise this was an umbrella sim. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Come on, move aside. This is maybe my dad's funeral. Or my mum's. Yes, I know we're part of the Red Sea. Oh, the affair your father had with that young woman nine years ago and her ensuing suicide broke our family apart forever. I imagine exactly what was going through your head in that moment. Oh, but then, look, my father no longer exists for me. I can only trust my mother. that your father had irreparably betrayed our trust and that she had done the right thing by throwing herself off that cliff. Oh my god, was that the right thing? Shit me. I was there. I've always been there. When you dislocated your shoulder at the first game, when you sobbed at night in a room you didn't recognise, and when... Dot, dot, dot. You kissed Duncan Forbes under the Christmas mistletoe in 1985. You marched against abortion in your first year at college. Oh, so is this me reading the letter but also reminiscing about my mum? Thank you, maybe. Matey. Hello, AK. Thank you very much for the sub as well, friend. And how are you doing? Have you played this one before? Have you played this one before? Also, let me know if you think uh, if you think it's too loud. Not if I'm too loud. You'll have to deal with my volume. Uh, but, but anything else. I hope you're doing well. I hope you haven't been melting today in the heat. Duncan was a good kid, but even if I've never said so before, I immediately thought you wouldn't have a lot to talk about. Talking is the foundation for every relationship. If you don't talk, you drift apart. There's so much to say when you don't have a lot of time to say it. First of all, I'm sorry. The game is louder than me. Thanks, thanks for the heads up. Okay, how's that? How's that? Hopefully better. Hopefully better. Yeah, good. Good. Cheers, you're a good egg. Uh, first of all, I'm sorry. Oh, we're still walking. I guess we are walking to my mum's funeral then. It does sound a bit a bit heavy, AK, yeah, but um, it was intriguing to me, and it was like, I, I paid less than £3 for it on the Switch as well, so I was like... Sure, it, it might be it might be an experience. Like we played we played that brothers, a tale of two sons on this year's charity stream, and it was also fucking whimsical and magical until the very very end. And oh my god, it broke me! It broke me. So um, but still, I'm I'm glad I experienced it. And maybe as heavy as this may be, we, we might have the same we might have the same experience. Uh, I never thought rage was an emotion worthy of a good Christian. But I used it. I used it to endure pain. I don't want you to live your life like I have, my love. I want you to be free from the past once and for all. That is why I want you to do it exactly as I say. Sell our hotel. Oh, okay. 
Okay, I'll be minted then. I'll be mint. That's my inheritance. Right there. The hotel is my family's, and you're entitled to it. Go back there, Nicole. I've hired a lawyer in Helena. Mr. Jenkins, to give you this letter once your father has passed away. I will... I will already be long gone. Take a quick inspection, sign the papers, and sell those walls that hold nothing but rage. Keep what you need to pay off your university loans, and give the rest of the girls and family. Let's end this story once and for all. Okay. We've always been there for each other. I wish I could still be there at your graduation. Your wedding. My grandchildren's birth. Presumptuous. I might not want kids. Mum? Uh, did you think of that? No. You only think about yourself. Use yours to love. There's nothing else worth living for. Fighting for or dying for. Believe me. I love you above all else. Your mother, June 24th, 1991. The beard, that beard looks good. Thanks, friend. Thanks very much. How are you doing as well, Dom? And, I mean, how, how's your beard situation? How's your beard situation? Um, if you want, we could uh, we could trade clippings one day. Um, next time I have a bit of a trim, I'll send you some of mine. You send me some of yours. Doesn't matter from what part of your body it comes from. Uh, I'm not fussy. I just glue it to my face. It's slowly growing, not as majestic as yours. Mine has been slow going, though. Has been slow going. Uh, and to be honest, the only reason I ever ever had a beard to start with was, was out of laziness. Um, but I, I, I prefer the bearded look than without. You look like a hobo nowadays? Wow, man, that's a beautiful hobo right there. Uh, let's keep going. Are we gonna Are we gonna see my mum? Are we gonna see my, I, I guess we are. You're getting hair on your cheeks. Which cheeks? Both, <laughs> both sets? And not just your ass cheeks. Oh, there we are. Oh, here we go. Mummy. Don, have you played this one before? Are you familiar with it? I'm not so much. I get the gist of it from like the blurb I read when I bought it. Other than that, nothing. This is new to you. Well, let's experience it together. It's a bit fucking bright. Oh my god. Look how, look how much it illuminates my face. This is just off the TV screen in front of me. Oh, baby, thank you very much. Oh my goodness, 86 gift subs in this channel. Me. Oh my god, what a good egg. Thank you so much. With above average winds and snowfall, especially Isn't he a sexy man? He's a sexy host. National Forest Natural Reserve. The National Weather Service warns well, that, residents <coughs> that is very, very kind of you, friend. Thank you. Given by local authorities and to avoid all unnecessary travel. Some well, now Don's at it as well, paying it forward. Oh, what bunch of good eggs you all are. What bunch of good eggs you all are. A single night. Are we heading into the mother of all winners in Lewis I hope you guys have been paying County? attention because I've not been listening. Um, and I haven't been reading the subtitles either. I haven't been reading the subtitles. <laughs> uh, oh, I guess this is a, this is a loading screen. I feel like it could have been loading while it was playing that little scene. Um, seems like lazy game development. Uh, in my opinion, you should always hide your loading behind uh, stuff like that, and then you know you don't you don't keep your players waiting. I know that from my extensive game development background, guys, <laughs> for all one of them. <laughs> so it does suck. It does suck. You're right. You're right. We're in twenty. Well, in 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 defense of this game, it was released in twenty twenty. So maybe we can give it the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> oh, are we in? This is yes. Mel. It's all I remember from the night we departed ten years ago. Right. Hopefully we're okay sound level wise now, guys. Uh, oh, mom's car. Can we investigate mom's car? Can we get in it? Are we even at the hotel now? Mom. Mom's car. We can't get it. This looks a bit bright and red, doesn't it? This little tool chest. No. Faulty lamp. It looks like it works just fine to me. Oh, it is flickering, I guess. Fragile. Can we? Can we interact? Hang on. Let's just let's just check our butons just to make sure uh, we're aware of what buton does what. Zoom. Use current object. Previous floor. Next floor. Oh, fuck you. Um, open map. We got a map. Ah, A for interaction. We've got run, we've got dynamo, we've got microphone, and we've got... What do we need a microphone for? What do we need a microphone for? 
Anyway, let's check. Have we got a map? Look at this. We do have a map. Oh, my goodness. And we've got a to-do list with nothing on it. Uh, and where are we right now? I guess we're in the garage. It doesn't show us in the garage, but that seems like a likely place for us to be. So we go to the locker room, the boiler room, the laundry. There's a church here. Hmm. A lot of shit. A lot of shit. Um, well, let's explore the garage. Um, oh, look at that. A blizzard outside. Look at it. It's blowing the shut here. I could do with a nice blizzard in, in my pants, guys. It's it's a bit warm. It's a bit warm. Can we investigate this? Look, there's a, there's a buton here. It even says buton. Oh, my God. Like, can we press the buton? Up. Down. I mean, it is already down. No? All right. Maybe it will tell us when we can interact with something. Um, is that too much to, to expect? Oh, 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 oh. Observe. Hey, I'm going to observe it. You ready? That was worth it. <laughs> that was worth it. I, I feel I, I'm much more enlightened now as to what I was looking at. Now I've picked up. I'm, I'm very slowly rotating it. I, th I think we've seen enough. We can put it down. Oh, hang on. No. There we go. Give it, give it the old spin. All right, now, now we can put it down. Is it piss? I think so. Maybe. Should we check if they're both piss? Yeah, they're both piss. Is, is it my piss? How long have I been here? I thought I just drove here, but maybe I've been trapped in here. Um, oh, hello, hello. Right, so this door. High voltage. Do not touch. <laughs> Sounds like this is the way to go, right? Can we go through? No? What about you? No? Well, I, I always like to pee in a bottle for easy storage um, and retrieval at a later date. Um, man, we walk so slow. Uh, this door is ajar. That door, locker room. Well, shall we go this way? No, 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 no. Because look, checking and reception are that way too. Let's try locker room first, and that might cut off our other options. Um, so if I look at the map, locker room seems to just lead to itself, and then everything else we can go. I oh, know we can't get to the boiler room, I guess, can we? Is that behind the locked door? Oh no, that was the electric room. Right, I see. I'm figuring you out, map. I'm figuring you out. No, somebody's somebody's barricaded it. All right, we're not going that way. We're not going that way. A faded mural, is it? Oh yes. Hey, I remember you from the loading screen. I don't want to remember you from the loading screen. I'm still salty about that. Right. Use. There we go. We've made progress. We, we've opened a door that was already partly open. The attorney said to check the office first. It should be just beyond the mountain museum at the end of the stairs to the main floor, if I remember right. Okay, thanks game. Alright, we need to... Is that on our to-do list? It's not even on our to-do list to check the office. Uh, let's look at the next floor. Oh my goodness, look at this! It's a big place. None of this says office. Oh, except that bit says offices. Hey, Pearcraft, how's it going, man? Boiler room. Employees only? I own it. I'm selling it. Oh, what if we saw, like, a man? What if we saw a man in there with his cock out? How's tricks? Tricks are alright, mate. Tricks are alright. It's just it's just a bit warm. You know? Just a bit warm. Oh, hello? It's phone ringing. Uh, is it up here? Let's follow the noise. Let's follow the noise. Where's the phone? Guys, you have to help me out, see if you can see it. Hello? Map. Map. Where have I come to? I wish it would show me where I was. Uh, which room am I in now? I must be in the hall. I must be in the hall. Bloody hot. It is bloody hot. Climbing rope. Uh, hello, phone? Uh -huh. Oh, I bet it's on the front desk. Is this it? No. It's a bell. Can I ding it? Can I ding it? No. Uh, the ring is definitely coming. Ah, hang on. Office? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. L ZL to zoom. Which one's that? Oh, my God. Yeah. Right, where's the phone? Where is the phone? Aha! It's in there. I've zoomed in. I've seen it. Probably telesales. Oh, it's voicemail! Right, hang on. Can we have a listen? Nine one one emergency. How can 
I help you? What's your emergency? Hey, why you you call me? Hello? Can you hear me? What's your emergency? So wait, wait, did Mr. McGrath. Hi, it's Paulie from Century Telephone Company. I'm sorry to bother you, but as I told you last time, the company requires cutting off the telephone service to delinquent customers. I I'm really sorry, Leonard. Oh yeah, fuck Leonard. He cheated on my mum. On my mom. We have to go ahead. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Right, but clearly the phone service got reconnected then. And somebody, uh, yeah, somebody's Nicole, calling the cops. It's Jenkins, the attorney. The hotel chain that wants to take over your hotel has just dumped a mammoth holy bible of documents on my desk that I need to check through. I have to personally go to the county land registry office before we meet. Listen, I know you didn't want to go to your father's funeral, but now the hotel is entirely your property. The law requires you to assess its condition before putting it on the market. Is that not what we paid uh, the guy for? It's uh, very noble of your mother to want to repay that poor girl's family, Rachel. Not everyone would deprive themselves of such a sum. Anyway, it's up to you now. Get to it. I'll bring you a burger you Portland folks can only dream of. Oh, I, I left you some notes and a master key on the dining room table of your family's old apartment. Start your rounds from there. Give me a couple of hours. Don't run off, all right? Right. So, dining room table, my old apartment, is where I need to head, I guess. That's not here, though. We should it? have hired a decent attorney from Portland, Mom, not this potato head. You're not this potato head, Mom. Come on, let's do this. All right, where is... So, I'm in offices. Let's, let's go through the map. Museum. Master Suite? Do you think that could be... Do you think that could be it? Where I need to go? Or maybe apartments up on... Nope. Or is the Master Suite? Ah! Mr. Jenkins said he left the management key in the Master Suite. Alright, alright. We're going upstairs then. We're going upstairs. We'll figure it out. It would be much easier if this map showed me where I was on it, um, instead of me having to pay attention. All right, can we investigate these financial records? No, we just know that they are financial records. We can't investigate them. Never mind then. Oh, oh my God, is that mold? Oh, disgusting! Disgusting. Right, let's find the stairs, shall we? Not here. Oh, hey, 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 I see him. I see him, right, so we'll go up here. Uh, it's really quiet here, which I suppose is a good thing, because supposedly I'm the only person here, right? This place is empty. Man, Nicole, you walk so slow. So, so slow. Uh, first floor, that's where we want to go, right? It's really well lit. Am I paying for am I paying for all this, this electricity? Uh while while nobody's here? The place has been empty. And all these lights were on before I even got here. There's another phone here. Uh rooms one oh nine to one one seven. Where's the master suite? Second floor? No. Ahaha, master suite. Alright, we're on our way. It's like walking through the Overlook Hotel guys. We're getting shining vibes from this. This is probably the quietest game ever. I can barely even hear me walking on like the carpet. Do I have feet? That's why we don't hear it. I don't have feet. Um, Master Suite, which way? Which way? How about we map it? How about we map it? Uh, I think this way then. Are you going to be Master Suite? Oh, those those shutters are going a bit wild. No, not through there. Okay. 108. Does the map have um? Does the map have the numbers on? Can I zoom in on the map? Oh, I can zoom in on the map. Ah ha ha. Right, 108. So that door does lead to the master suite. Ah, but actually no, the other way. The other way. The other way does. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. We we'll go this way. Past 105. So this should be 105. 
And then, aha, yeah, that I see it now. Master Suite. Here we go. Another phone that we can let ring, I guess. Uh, so he left the stuff on the dining table. Are you a dining table? Oh, last one, a testament. Can we zoom in? No. All right. I, Leonard McGrath, resident in the city of Helena, county of Montana, state of United States. Uh, being of sound mind, not acting under duress or undue influence, and fully understanding the nature and extent of all my property and of this disposition thereof, do hereby make, publish, and declare this document to be my last will and testament, and hereby revoke any and all other wills and codicils heretofore made by me. I direct that all my debts and expenses of my last illness, funeral and burial be paid as soon after my death as may be reasonably convenient, and I hereby authorise my personal representative hereinafter appointed to settle and discharge in his or her absolute discretion any claims made against my estate. I further direct that my personal representative shall pay out of my estate any and all estate and inheritance taxes payable by reason of my death in respect of all items included in the computation of such taxes, whether passing under this will or otherwise. Said taxes shall be paid by my personal representatives as if such taxes were my debts without recovery of any part of such tax payments from anyone who receives any item included in such computation. Uh, and that is Claire Wilson uh, was my personal rep was Leonard's personal representative. Uh, I devise and bequeath my property both real and personal and wherever situated as follows. First beneficiary, me, Nicole Wilson. Oh wait, was Claire my mum? Claire might have been my mum then. Uh, Nicole Wilson, currently of whatever that address is, is my daughter, whose last four digits of social security number are... We, I can't read that. So I get left the hotel. Can we... Oh, look, we can rotate this. Is it double-sided? Look. He left me his most favourite thing, guys. He left me a page of jokes for blind people. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. He was always thinking of me. He always wanted to make me laugh. Right, let's put that down then. We've investigated that. Can we investigate... Aha, Jenkins' letter. Okay, dear Miss Nicole Wilson, recipient, that's me, this is to inform you that the nominated personal representative, Claire Wilson, is intended to transfer the property of Leonard McGrath's last will and testament. All the ownership rights and responsibility are now attributed to the recipient, that's me. Please acknowledge receipt of this letter and confirm indicating your consent to the above transmission, returning it to me in a correct envelope. If I do not receive your reply objection to the proposed transfer, I will assume that you accord to it and that there will not be any future problems regarding the owning of the property named above. Thanks for your attention in this matter. I really can't stand lawyer fucking jing lingo, guys. I can't I can't get my head around it. I think they do it on purpose to confuse people. Are there supposed to be keys here? What was on... He left the management key in the master suite. I thought he left everything on this table, but he just left these documents. Um... Well, this liar. No? We can't. We'll just burn the hotel down. We'll claim the insurance money. Maybe we'll get more from the insurance than we do from selling it. <gasps> oh, look. This is... This is... They went a long time between measuring this kid. Like, mini Rusty, I swear. She wants to get measured every fucking day. And we're like, the line's going to be in the same place. She's like, no, it's not. Look. I'm standing up really straight now. Yeah, you were standing up really straight yesterday, mate. Doesn't work like that. I'm one day taller. You ain't, mate. Calculations. Something about light bulb flux and luminosity? I don't know what this is about. Is this like some homework? We see what's on the front of the book. What does it say? It ever so slowly rotates. Uh, nope. Never mind. <gasps> A pen. Can we write with it? It seems we've got a lot of stuff we can interact with. Um, though it's pointless. Like that bottle of piss we found earlier. What was the point of that? There was none. There was none. Oh, look, look how fun Montana is, guys. You can go fucking skiing. You can go fucking skiing in Montana. That, this poster has, has educated me today. Um, I didn't know that before. Uh, all at my room, my rules. Do you reckon he left it in my room? Or maybe in this room? Can we open the door? <gasps> we can, look. Right, in we go. Let's look. Clipboards. There. Oh no! Oh look! They turned the picture the other way around. Do you reckon that was Leonard, or that was the picture of my mum? Oh my God! It looked like a demon child. No, 
should be straight straight into an orphanage. Um, she she's got those weird eyes. Leonard's book. Oh, why can't we zoom in on this shit? Can't see your smile, honey. It's not like some sort of poetry. Rachel doesn't want to do her speech therapy exercises. Love you, Rachel. Who's Rachel? Oh wait, Rachel's the Rachel's the chick who killed herself. Rachel's the chick who committed suicide. Leonard's cup. NASA. Anything in it? What's he been drinking? Nothing. No wonder he died. He wasn't feeding himself. Hockey trophy? No, it's a music box, apparently. Can we interact? No. He loves space. Look at this. So, so far we've had a lot of walking around. Uh, and not a lot of doing anything. Hopefully, we'll find a key. Ooh, look at this. My room is so fucking cool. Everyone loves space. Look, got fucking... Look, look at this rocket here. exactly the same as when me and mom left ten years ago. So, can we wear the hat? Doesn't matter. Nope, Quick can't wear the hat. It's ruined it for me. There's no point playing this game if we can't wear a hat. I'm not even wearing a hat in real life, so I needed to wear one in the game. It's been stolen from me. Oh, hello. Let's, let's turn this off. Let's talk about victims in the last three days. I don't think I want to hear this. <gasps> ah, key! Management key. Let's have it. No? Maybe we have to listen to the radio before we can do anything else. I'm starting to see maybe this is why the game was less than three pounds uh, in the sale for me. Right, radio's radio's done. Can we pick up the key now? This is the manager yes. key my mom wouldn't give me when I was little. Huh. I'll need a master key for the guest rooms though. Okay, so if I go to a management office, maybe. I'll get a master key for the guest rooms. Hello. Look, can we get this little walkie-talkie? Is it a walkie-talkie, or was that just what phones were like in like the 80s when I was a kid? Oh, look, I loved hockey. Maybe my dad was a hockey player, and I like I idolised him before the affair. Anyone in here? Oh, look, we've sealed it with a sticker. We've sealed it, so we'll know if anyone's hiding in there, because the stickers would be broken. So that's how we know the boogeyman isn't in the closet. He's under the fucking bed! Aha! Uh -huh. No, no, no one there. We're safe for now. Got a base. Got a base. Nobody needs a base. <laughs> Nobody needs a base player. Um, okay, so where is the management office? So if we go have a look. So we've got offices. Should we just go back to the offices downstairs? There's a fridge nearby. Right, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going to go back downstairs to the offices. Uh, what's on my to-do list? Ah, nothing. <laughs> That's useful. That's useful. Thanks, game. Oh, oh, hang on, the phone. The phone. I'm coming. I'm coming. Hang on, please. I know where you are. I just need to get to you. Hello? Wait. Yeah. Oh, you motherfucker. Is it the one in my room? Oh, no. They're... We're never going to make it now. Never going to make it. I'm coming. Please. <laughs> oh, there is a run, Buton. There is a run, Buton. Hello? Is this a joke? Hello? Can, can you hear me? Is this Miss McGrath? Wilson. McGrath was my father's. Uh, uh, this is um, uh, Helena Federal Emergency Management Agency. Uh, my name is uh, Irving Crawford. Uh, Mr. Jenkins told me you'd be arriving. Mm. Uh, Mr. Jenkins is a very enterprising man. Oh, uh, I, I guess so. I, I wouldn't know. I'm kidding. Oh, right. Any reason for your call, Irving, from Federal... What you call it? Uh, I'm calling to emergency you something. during your stay at the hotel. What? Uh, the Timberline is old but sturdy. You'll enjoy your stay and, and be safe, no problem. Uh, the furnace, wiring, it, it's all under control. Oh, okay, enough. What? I don't know what Jenkins told you, but I have zero intention of staying here longer than, let's say, 20 minutes. Oh. Look but, at but this. Storm. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, it doesn't matter. I'm leaving straight away. <laughs> <laughs> this one's shit. Thanks this one's shit. But, Irving, but this one. Right? Irving. I like. Yeah. I. You. Uh, oh my god, this one. Shit. 
Oh my god, look, you can see the progression of unicorns. Do you reckon I did all of this art? Look at this one, though, look. That's the unicorn that had a fight with Voldemort in the graveyard, and then Harry's parents showed up at the side of it. <laughs> Cedric was like, don't leave my body here, Harry. It's a magic horn. Do you reckon that's, that's what she loved about this room? Look, even the fucking lava lamp was on. Who turned all this shit on? Hang on, what's going on here? Oh, I thought that was somebody getting bummed. I thought that was somebody getting bummed. It's just a hockey hockey picture. All right. So, to-do list, do we have anything? No. I am going to go downstairs now, assuming no phones ring. Um, I lo this is me running. Look how this fast I go. This is a real mess. Never thought to find anything like that. So we'll we'll go downstairs to the office. Is my... What the fuck was that? Hello? I think somebody's in here. Hello? Do you hear the banging? What is that? Hello? I don't know what it is or where it's coming from. I'm going to go with my original plan of going into the offices. Now I've got this key. Um, what what does it do? Do you think? How do I see my my inventory? Oh, hang on. Let's have a look at settings. See what the butons are. So use current object. How do I get the object in my in my hand? Not yet, not yet. Uh, there's some banging going on. I don't know what's where it's coming from. So my my dad's died. I've been left this hotel. Um, I need to sell it. I'm gonna use a little bit of money to pay off my university loans, and then I am gonna give the money to the girl's family, the girl who killed herself, who my dad had an affair with. That's what I've got out of this. Um, Ah, Dad's office. So, does the key... Maybe the key unlocks this. Aha! Oh. Um. I think the banging is getting louder. God, look at the state of these sinks. That is disgusting. Well, we've got some more doors. I don't know what I don't know what that key was supposed to open. Then it probably wasn't anything to do with the kitchen, was it? Oh, mouldy food, Chris. Ugh. What if we get trapped in here and we die? Right, let's go. Oh, well, I don't mind admitting I'm a little, a little lost, a little bit confused as to what we're supposed to be doing right now. Uh, do we really want to be going back downstairs? Probably not. down there? No, we won't fit down there. We won't fit down there. Right, so where... 
Where do you think we are now? So we walked out of the kitchen through some double doors. So we must be the other side of the fireplace room? Do you reckon, do you reckon that's what's up here? This will be the fireplace room, if I'm looking at that map right. Aha. Uh -huh. Also a mess. Ah, thank you, to-do list. What's this din? What's this din coming from the Overlook? All right, so the Overlook is back upstairs then. And it was right next to the fucking master suite. It was, it was right next to the master suite. Oh, I'm not happy about this. Um, I swear I looked at my to-do list before I started running around getting lost like a dickhead. All right, let's go. Let's go back. Let's go back upstairs. Thanks, game, making me look like a right twat. There's so much din coming from the Overlook guys. Look at this. I'm a pro. I know my way around this place. Do you reckon it's just a shutter blowing in the wind? That's got to be what it is, right? Right, so upstairs a bit more. So is the overlook, I think, is the way I went before, where I thought the master suite was on, on the right? This way. Is this... Yeah, look. See, that was already, that was already banging. We saw this through the window before. It's going a little bit crazy though. Oh, oh, it's gone. It's got that's quite that's quite a storm. Should we have a look out the window? Am I Hello? reporting to? Hey, you still oh, there? Irving. Irving? Huh? Oh yeah, uh, I'm still here, Miss McGrath. I, I mean, Miss Wilson. When you said this shack was sturdy... Oh, that's what I was trying to tell my dad would just sit here. Uh, sit here with his, weather, with his brandy. How much time do I have to move? Uh, just well, looking uh, out at the, the broken shutters. pretty quick, and uh, uh, some parts over 3,000 feet are already icing over. I gotta risk it. Uh, you're not thinking of taking the car. Let's see if we can see Sasquatch. Um, oh, uh, obviously yes. Uh, of course we are. Yeah. Uh, listen. If your car uh, breaks down, we can't come get you. Not even with tanks. Whatever happened to Miss Wilson? Uh, oh, uh, sorry about that. I, I just... Uh... Nicole is fine. That said, thanks for everything. Again. Thanks. Uh, seriously, if you ended up out there with your car gone dead, with 12 inches of snow and 20 degrees below zero, your lungs would collapse in a few minutes. I remember how so it'd be a quick death the then. Mountains. I don't know what he's worried Luck about. Doesn't exist. I wouldn't suffer. As a, a FEMA agent, I have to insist... You know, you're not the first man... To, to do what? To try and stop me. Hey, uh, wait! Bye! Yeah, bye. See you later, Irving. What can go wrong? I have a 1986 Dodge. Yes. What could go wrong? We could get lost again. Let's look at our to-do list. Let, we'll, we'll check it now and see if it's got nothing there. Ready? Aha! take back the car and uh, get away from here before the storm arrives. Well, we, we can do that. We go back to the garage. Uh, can we take these stairs? Where do they go? They go down. Good. That's where we want to go. Ooh, look at this. I won't stay here. Must be the dining room. No way. The attorney, he'll take care of everything. Staff only storage. Oh, you're right. Okay, so we've been in there just from the other way. Uh, I wonder when and where we get the guest room keys from then. We're gonna because we're gonna have to check them out surely. Oh, look, this is reservations. Terrible handwriting. Can't can't read a word. It's not legible. Oh, should we see the menu? 1982 Christmas a menu. Spaghetti meat sauce 65. 65 what? Meatball, 75. This is quite pricey, guys. Especially, look, you can get a tenderloin steak for 195. Or is that supposed to be maybe 195? And they just put a weird, a weird comma in there. I don't know. 
I don't know. Aha! Oh, right, I see. Oh, oh, shut yourself. Haunted. Haunted. Right, so let's go back downstairs then. Get our car and get out of here. Game complete. Game complete. Well, she said we'd stay here 20 minutes. We've been streaming 40, so really she spent twice as long here as she needs to. Uh, is this my car? It, is, yeah, it even says my car. Beautiful. Right, let's get in. Oh, we're gonna, we've got to let Tell Irving know what we're doing mind. first. You there? Uh -huh. uh, oh, yeah, right. Uh, it's a direct line. I can't find my car keys. My fucking car keys. I left them on the seat. You sure? Someone took them. think so. Maybe someone... <sighs> no, listen. This office is about 12 miles from the hotel. Uh, they're the definitely not there. It's 40 miles by road. There's nothing or no one in between, and that's not a good thing right now. God damn it, I knew it. Uh, oh, maybe the keys are in your pocket. Wow, yeah, that off, didn't mate. even cross my mind. Fuck off, mate. Only trying Oop. to help. Yeah, that was kind of bitchy. No problem. Uh, the keys will turn up. Uh, the good news is that we have these new cell phones. Uh, that's what they call them. Uh, radio doesn't reach out there. I bypass the signal to create a direct line through a shortwave sequencer. It's like a two-way radio station that's always open. Oh, so at least I can always talk to her. I vowed to never come bored. back. Listen, I might only be a voice, but sometimes a voice is all I need, guys. If you need me, just call. Seriously. Oh, <sighs> fine. Yep, yeah, fine. Cheers, Irving. Right, so we got to track down my keys, I guess. Uh, maybe I dropped them down here. Look. No. No keys. To-do list? What have you got for me? I have to open the garage door. Oh, wait. Even without without the car? Without the keys? And all this snow's coming, though. Right, let's press the buton. No, oh, not working, Irving. Talk to me. Nobody's I ever going to buy this shit old hotel. It's a conspiracy, damn it. Uh, the stuff freezes up with the cold. I have to get out of here. I'm not sure you get it. Look, I left this place ten years ago. I had no idea I would have to come back here, let alone stay a night. Nicole, I know your story. Everyone in the valley knows it. Your father. Yeah, all right. Rachel. Don't don't be dr bringing up my past, mate. Uh, that name. Should we say that name? That name. I haven't heard that name since I left. I didn't want to be out of line. Don't mention the past. Okay. That's what I said. Don't bring it up, mate. Alright, come up with solutions, not with traumatic past experiences. Uh, Alright, check the old to-do list. Nothing. Shall we try the buton again? What's the worst that could happen? It just doesn't do anything. That's, that's what. Okay. So, it doesn't open. We don't know where our keys are. We don't have anything on our... Oh. Sorry, Irving's back. Hey, uh, loves the sound of his own voice. Anything useful? Mate, I've walked five no, steps. Of course I haven't. No keys, no garage door. I can't get out of here without freezing. Christ. It's probably only for a night. Uh, the conditions might get better tomorrow. They might? Uh, look, they might. I'll be on duty Why is everyone so non-committal, guys? Call me when you want. Even just to talk. Okay. Oh, thanks. Irving. Yeah, whatever. Thanks, just Irving. Just doing my job. Just fuck off, mate. Nicole? No, Ms. Wilson. Yeah. If I may. What? I'd like to give you some advice. If it comes with the job. You're safe up there. Just relax. It'll be fine. Yeah, whatever. Shall we go, uh, go okay. find a nice room? Uh, later. Well, we've got our pick of, of God knows how many. It. I'm stuck. Shit. Uh, shall we go in the boiler room? Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> well, I, I didn't think just that flashing up would scare me. Fucking hell. <laughs> Dickhead. Day one. Alright. We're only staying one day though, aren't we? Aren't we? Yes? Jesus Christ. We didn't even stay in my old room. We stayed in this one. Alright. What's on the to-do list? Nothing. Oh, talk to Irving. Hello? That's always on the to-do list. That's a given. Is That's that a, given. a joke? Yeah. Well, you're improving. What's up? 
Oh, nothing. I mean, I just wanted to say, you got everything you need to have a smooth night. Oh, so, oh, but hang on, so we haven't even spent the, the night yet. System. You know, no one's been up there since... Leonard's death. Right, take a look at the main power. So the, the power room was like back downstairs where I was. Age. I don't know. When I lived here, I was only a kid. I can barely find the bathroom. Well, that's a good start. <laughs> like, at least I won't wet myself? Um, no. I, I didn't mean... Don't blush, kid. I was just kidding. Oh, <laughs> I just... I'll call if I need you. Yeah, I don't need you, Irving. I, I'm going to the power room. I know what I'm doing. I'm going to wire it up to my nipples. Um, and make the most of this day I've got by myself. And just experiment a bit, you know, get to know my body a bit more. It'll be fun. It'll be fun, just tasing my nips. Um, it's not on the to-do list, but it's where I'm going. Because that's what we were just talking about. So that seems to me like a clue, right, as to what we should be doing. Irving? It's me again, obviously. I could really use a shower. Oh, Irving, will sure. you join me? You'll just need to turn on the furnace for the hot water. Oh, my mom never wanted me to go down there, but I love Oh, that so that'll place. be the boiler room, I guess. Full of little spiders. A real country bumpkin. <laughs> oh, I was a pest. Now, I think I even forgot how to get there. I forgot almost everything about this hotel. Funny, right? I think it's right. So I was People supposed to come here what hurts, I think. and check never out enough, the condition of this place. Never enough. Before it gets yeah. sold. That's the only reason I'm here, to check well, it all over. Uh, furnaces he seems to know everything about it, and the condition of it, and all that it. shit. So what is the point of me? Uh, is there more? Is there something else I should know, like, to survive? Well, yeah, eat the moldy don't food. Don't expect a five-star menu. Eat the moldy food, oh, Nicole. really? Uh, you could survive for months with what's in the pantry. No, I can't. Let me guess. Canned beans, right? Bean soup. Baked beans, potatoes and beans, bean broth. <laughs> Starving suddenly seems like an acceptable option. Right, check to-do list. I need a shower, I must restart the furnace, so... I will go to the boiler room then, not the electricity room. It's only because he said some shit about the power. Right, so... Danger. Boiler room. Of course we're going to speak to Irvin again. Are you at the furnace? Hang on, oh, almost, mate. Jesus Christ. He's down there. What? Uh, what got? Uh, who? Old farting ghost. A farting ghost? What? Wait, what did you say? Old farting... <laughs> no, there's no farting ghost here. I used to hide down there with hotel guest kids and... I, mean, I, I, I know what she means, though, because farts are just like the ghosts of the food that you ate, aren't farting they? The furnace? <laughs> yeah. When I think that. She's flirting a little laughing. bit. She's, maybe she wants to split the inheritance like with, uh, with Irving yeah. now. Well, that's long gone. Right, I'll start the furnace in a minute. Can I can I investigate this stuff? Not the radio. There's a lot of ghosts around you then. <laughs> oh, what's this though? This looks interesting. Can't interact with it though. Um, about the lockers. Should check if there's anyone in there. Hello. Hello. This door. Where does that lead? Uh, let's have a look at the map. I'll go to the laundry. We don't want to go to the laundry. Let's start the furnace. Let's get naked. Some some women like to shower in a bathing suit, don't they? In a swimsuit. Um, so maybe Nicole is that kind of person. Right, let's press the buton. Not before we have to call Irving. It looks real complicated. It's real complicated, does it? Furnaces are all the same. Can you see the control panel? Furnace racist. I guess. What does the pressure gauge read? Uh, the thing that looks like a clock. Looks like two twenty. Oh. Oh yeah, that's that's high. I don't like the sound of oh. It's, 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 it's it right at the top. It should be more like two ten psi. Two ten. Pressure's building. All right. So we you need saying to, I have a choice between freezing it, or blowing up? <laughs> no. Push the green button. It's the starter. Oh, push the green what? Ghost, you rank spirit. Wake up. Huh? Green buton, Nothing, he means, I think. talking to an old friend. Click. He's that 
funny. It sounds fucking terrifying. Hello? And here he is, in tip top shape, I'd say. <laughs> you were right. Oh, yeah, the look at the farts coming out. <laughs> uh, now you've got hot water. You have no idea how grateful I am. Did I really yes, did I job. really need to call him to tell me to press the only the only button that was green? I think I could have guessed. I could have figured it out. So should we go back upstairs to the master suite? Oh, that's not the run button. Let's go back up to the master suite. Our shower. I guess is my it's gotta be let's look at the to-do. Not on there, obviously, but that's what we'll do. That's what we're doing. No, we're talking to fucking Irving again. Oh my god. Uh, just Hello, like Jedi. Know, How you doing, mate? How are you doing? The hallways. I just want to go to bed. Did you find a room you feel comfortable in? Yeah, my old room. It's exactly like I left it. Leonard cleaned it, but he didn't touch a thing. Same as you left it. I don't know. He touched that young girl. How does that make you feel? He touched that young girl. At FEMA? Um, okay. yeah, I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. Nice. It's endearing. But I'm not 16 anymore. Just hot, mate. There's That's all. Lots just of hot stuff. That's why there's no hat tonight. No. I think I'll sleep just fine. Okay. Right, so are we going to sleep or are we going to shower? Man's not hot. <laughs> uh, I'm dead tired. I'll sleep in my old room in the master suite. Alright, we're going. We're not showering now. After all that... Oh, fuck, I'm... Irving Crawford, FEMA. This is like fucking speak hey. to Irving simulator. Listen, I just wanted to say, if I come across as obnoxious, no problemo. <laughs> I get it. Almost feels like I'm getting used to being here again. And unless it turns out Whatever. he's in the hotel the whole Forget time. Forget it, I'm beat. Right? I'm rambling. No. He's in the hotel. He 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 talked about setting up this uh, this short wave two way radio thing because the, the no. signal can't get through right. but really it's because he's here he's in here mythology. he's un so he's that. under the fucking bed now he's in I'm he's under there chill in my room with the posters of my favorite bands playing my old bass totally unplugged thank you mate you play the bass oh I Jedi, thank you very much mate oh my goodness eight months as I well i didn't realize that didn't realize Knowing that. that i'm not alone here is i see you put the song on yeah, <laughs> it is no, quite a uh, tune in it thank you for um Listen, would uh, would Battleborn ever do a cover? Your car. So I owe you my life then. Can I just get into bed? Wow. It's just So job. Jedi, you've missed the evolution of unicorn pictures. So we've gone from this one Night. to here. Night. To here. To here. Aren't they beautiful? This this one's my favourite one, the real derpy one. Uh right, can we get into bed? No, we're not getting into bed. Is that not my thing? No. Am I supposed to play with the bass? Oh, look, a puzzle cube. Look at that. Solved it already, guys. So that's probably the quickest anyone's ever done it. Um, let's put it down. Base. Let's use it. Oh, look, she's doing it. She's doing it. Look, I have hands. Look at that. The way she walks those fingers. She's just getting warmed up for when she gets into bed, guys. You know, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Oh, day two. Didn't make me jump that time. Didn't make me jump that time. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. But AK, I'm I'm getting it out of my system now before it gets before it starts getting a bit heavy. All right. <laughs> That's all. That's all. You can forgive me for that. Day two. It, oh, here we are. Loading. Oh, we're back here. Back at the overlook. How's it looking? Still snowy. Still wind. Still windy. Oh, lovely blue skies though. Let's see if we can see anyone out there. Hello. Oh, morning. So I'll, I'll call with Ernie. Morning, Nicole. Mm. Get me sleep. Uh, suddenly out cold, as if somebody drugged me. I was wide awake for hours. Oh no, wide awake for hours. Suddenly, darkness. Mm. So, any news? Uh, uh, what? Is it? Is it better? Is it is done? Is the situation on the roads any better? Just uh, give me a sec to get it together. Maybe I need some coffee. I didn't get any shut eye last night, and wait, you didn't sleep? Like no, because he was stood over I your bed watching you. I need something, and but you watched me for nineteen I... and a half hours last month. You need to you get alive. I agree. 
You do, mate. You do. There's so much better stuff you could have done in 19 and a half hours. You could have learned a new language. You could have done one of those so, those uh, uh, those audio courses or something. Real soon. Probably tonight. Uh, you can't move, not well, I always appreciate in always theory. appreciate you hanging out. What do you want to do? But you can't be asked. <laughs> but having a life is overrated. Uh, I don't want to change the subject. I'm not ready for this kind of news at the crack of dawn. I'll eat and then I'll think about it. It's time for you to take a tour of the pantry. Is it? I could, I could ride a horse. Deal. I could eat a horse right now. Right, let's let's head downstairs. Baked beans will be scrumptious. I mean, you joke, but baked beans are fucking scrumptious. I had uh, I had hash brown uh, with beans on for lunch today. That was fucking great. Yesterday I had hash brown with beans on for lunch. It was fucking great. Uh, where are we headed? Oh, hang on, no, the kitchen is... The kitchen... I could get to the kitchen through here, couldn't I? Yeah, 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 yeah. I definitely could. I definitely could. Get a hash brown sign with butter and salt and vinegar. Ooh, my goodness. How exotic. Nicole? Irving? Uh, how long has it been since someone's inspected the pantry? Inspected? You mean stocked? I'd just like to know if I should choose between malnutrition and food poisoning. There'll Go for the poisoning. Things to eat. Go for the poisoning, because then oh, you can you can vomit no yourself thin roaches. that way. Pretty sure about that. I was thinking more like mold, bacteria and such. Uh, you'll see. There's nothing to worry about. I had an ant farm. What a random fucking thing. We're talking about the pantry. For a while I hid an ant farm in the closet. <laughs> I think Leonard suggested it. One morning my bed was swarming with ants. You must have freaked out. My mother did. The ant farm ended up straight in the trash. Your career as an entomologist nipped in the bud. Didn't think I still remembered all these little things. Yeah, I just want to open the door. I just want to open the door, Nicole. Right. Oh, oh, it's chilly in here. Aha! My beans! Wait, Muggo lunch! And we've got Mighty, Mighty Joe? Mighty Joe what? Condensed chicken soup? Ah, there we go. Bean soup. Oh, look at this, look at, look at this. Get the tin, microwave it, enjoy. That's, that's it, that's all there is to it. This is Betty Crocker! My mum's always going on about Betty Crocker and her cakes. I didn't know she did. Muggo lunch, though. Is that a real thing? Is that a real thing? Oh! Hello? <laughs> what the fuck was that? It's not on my to-do list. I don't investigate anything. Put the tin in the microwave. That's that's what it, that's what it said, mate. That's what it said. I can't pick it up again. Um, what was that bang? Am I locked in here? <gasps> I am. And then Irving's the other side going, ha ha ha, my hotel now. Hey, you kidding? You kidding? We'll find a way out. We can squeeze through here, right? We can squeeze through here. Nicole's only little. She's petite. She's a size zero. I don't even know what a size zero is. Should we just try the door again? Just pull it harder. No? Oh, it's fine. It's fine, it's, it's open. She was just making. Hang on. Was oh, this door uh, always broken? Forgot. There might be a problem with the fridge door. Just make sure it doesn't. Are you close. fucking with me? No. Wait. What did I say? It would have been more useful to know that before I got locked in. Oh, yeah. Holy shit! I'm a freaking space cadet. <laughs> I'm a yeah, freaking space cadet. I could have died in there. <laughs> Do you know what? Actually, guys, I I used to work in a in a pub kitchen, right? And uh, for a time, there were there were three of us there. Before these other two, the, the two Welsh guys, um, Carl and Chris. Uh, actually, no. We'll, let's not use their real names. We'll say Chris and Carl were the the other two guys who worked there for a time. And we would have competitions to see who could last longest in the walk-in freezer. Um, so we we'd take turns to just go in there and sit on like a sit on a big box in there, and the other guys would just shut the door, uh, and we'd. Would time it. Um, I didn't do very good, but Chris, 
he didn't give a shit, mate. He was he was just in there. He took a torch with him and a magazine, and he was quite happy. He was quite happy. Then they both quit one day because the uh, the manager wouldn't let him have a day off to watch a, a rugby match or something, which I guess is like a, a, a big insult to a Welshman to not be allowed to watch rugby or something. Um, so that just left me. Head chef by default uh, was, was what that was. The microwave could be useful to heat the beans. Yes, we saw the instructions. Let's find a microwave. If I was a microwave, where would I be? You can think of bigger insults to Welshmen. I, I I could think of them too, but I think if you were if you were trying to insult them, but this I guess was an accidental insult. Uh, where's the microwave? I on is this it? Are you? There's a fucking there's a broom in the way. Let's use this one. It's just it's going straight in. It's going straight in. Look out. Take cover. Uh, we'll, we'll head behind this door. Wait for it to explode. Then we know the beans are ready. Look at the state of this floor. And look, somebody's jizzed over here. Oh, disgusting. Disgusting. This is a kitchen. It's a kitchen, mate. Don't forget to put my spoon in the microwave, too. So actually, my, my aunt, <laughs> one year, got, uh, I think, my mum, my dad, and maybe a couple of my brothers, these really ugly ugly mugs at Christmas uh, and they're all like metallic like coated so it was like a red one a green one a blue one and I think a gold one and they they were a ugly shape the metallic mugs as well they were ugly and my mum put one in the microwave I think she did it on purpose just so she wouldn't have to have to keep it but she couldn't bring herself to just throw it away or just not use it and put it in the back of a cupboard she had to destroy it first the more metal, the quicker it cooks. Ah, oh, that's right. That is right. Um, I hear you. Fuck off, you dingy fucker. Um, there we are. Muggo lunch. Let's see. You didn't even get anything on the spoon, Nicole. Anorexia, guys. It's a, it's a, it's a real thing. Thank you, matey. We had it though. We ate it. Jasmine, thank you very much for the sub. Look at this. Twelve months as well. Uh -huh. Sorry to interrupt your You can have a fancy process. twelve month uh, sub badge as well. Jenkins, the attorney. Um I'm only taking good news. I'm only taking I'm good only news taking today. Good news How'd the rest of your stream go this morning? Let me eat. Up to you. Thought you'd like to know. Oh come on. He called nine one one after just a mile. I'll finish the inspection. Well, I'll investigate it myself. Well finish the inspection. I can do it without Jenkins. Yeah, we've seen uh, her he play bass. We know she can do it by herself, sure. guys. He says to... Hmm. This is a swear word, and you don't need to hear it. Uh, yeah. Uh, Nicole, at this point, start assessing the general conditions of the hotel on your own. Uh, jot down what you want to keep. I recommend you start with the second floor. Oh, we haven't even been up to the, the second floor yet, have we? Please, only call me if you've got good news. Yeah, we, we have had enough of talking to Irving, really. We don't need to talk to him as often as we are. It seems like we take five steps and then we're on the radio again. And then I can't do anything else. So, to do this should say, yes, inspect the second floor first. So let's go. Let's leg it. Let's leg it up them stairs. Oh, no. Where's that going? Man, we haven't done Volcano for a while, guys. Oh, Hello. I don't know, we shouldn't be in here. We're a lady. Oh, there's no mirrors. That's convenient, so we can't see ourselves. Look at this one, though. Oh my God, is this paint or blood? Paint or blood? Ah, uh, there's a paintbrush here. It says vandals. Oh, vandals. Who's vandalized my thing? What did they... What do they paint? I think that says dye. And somebody's painted over it. Or dig. Or pie. Should we check? Hello? I hope you're decent. Can we lift the toilet? Can we have a look? We have a look. You think pig? You think pig? Uh, should we see if there's any poo? No poo. No poo. You? No poo. You? Any? No poo! Oh. Maybe we'll have to go find the ladies' room if we want to see. Oh, hello. Is this a secret fucking door? No, I think it's just like a 
Yeah, no, look, it looks it looks like a secret. Well, hardly secret. So it's dick pic. Oh my god, fucking hell. <laughs> Alright, shall we see if there's anything on the opposite wall then? Nah. Oh unless unless that's a penis. No, it looks like looks like some some reindeer having a fight. That's what it looks like to me. Um alright. Ah, the women! Alright, let's have a look in there. What have they done in here? Not been vandalized from the looks of it. Shall we check all the toilets in here? Shall we see if there's anything? How you been getting on in Dark Souls? Obviously, I saw how you... Oh, hello? Jesus! Sometimes I think that when I'm having a shit, guys. Sometimes. I think we've all been there. When you get that burning in your asshole, you're like, oh my god, that's, that's Satan's fire right there. But no, it's just a bad shit. But we all wish Jesus was there for us in the in those times, don't we? Um, have they all got them in there? Is that like you know how you've got like a disabled cubicle in each toilet? Is is there like a is there a god one, or do they all have it? Let's have a look. No, look, see that one hasn't got it. That one hasn't got it. They all get progressively darker. I don't like it. It's to clamp down on on a difficult one. Oh man, gross. Gross. Uh, we came the wrong way, then, to, to go upstairs. So we'll go this away, I think. Yes, through the fireplace room. Yes. You beat it last night, but you want to get all the trophies. It's, I mean, it looked, it looked bad enough. I see, hung around for a little bit yesterday. That big old dragon boy. Fuck me. Right, second floor. Let's go. I've not done any demon souls for, for a while. Um, I'm going to get back to it. I'm going to go back to grinding to level my guy up before I actually then try the next boss. Just, just so I can try and make myself not OP, just slightly P. Just like on a level, on a par with the boss would be nice. Right, second floor. Here we go. It's going to be the most damaged, apparently. Which way should we go first? Look, somebody's, somebody's knocked the bin over. We'll go that way. Lowercase p. <laughs> that, that's about right. That's about right. Oh, what about mold? Ugh. Let's report it. Irving, there's mold here. There's some serious water stains on the second floor. That floor is pretty run down. There's some windows missing and water damage, too. Yeah. Oh, hello. Look, look, look. This one's open a little bit. Hello. Is this where we walk in and we see the old lady in the bathtub? Is that... Is this it? Looks like a council property. Do you think? Hello? That's weird that you've got, like, tiling behind... You've got tiling behind the bed. Is that is that like a splash guard for your jizz? <laughs> Oh my god, never seen such a thing. Um, and look, somebody can just sit in this chair, they sit in this chair and they watch. They're like, yeah, oh, go on, go on, fucking jizz all up those tiles. Jizz all up those tiles. I'm gonna head off, have a good one. Oh, thanks for coming by. Thanks for coming by, bro. You have a good one as well. Oh, the room check. They check it. I can't zoom in on this. Um, something, something, enough is enough. Ah, stink and noise in the walls. Is there rats? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh. Oh, hello. Someone's been doing a ritual in here? Maybe? Um. What the fuck is this? We can't even we can't even we can't even look at it. We can't observe it. But I, look. That looks like some weird fucking shit right there. That's some occult shit right there. We just got candles. What is it? Hmm. I don't think I like that room. I don't. I think that was. I think that was Mrs. Busty out outside the door. That scared the shit out of me. Unless it was a rat I heard in the wall in my ear. Sealed door. Do we have to? Um. Yep. Yeah, we have to report it. I'm sure he knows about it. Here I am. Uh, what's up? The hallway on the second floor is cut off. The door to the west wing is locked. 
Your father started renovations, but he didn't get the bank loan and had to stop. Yeah, look up there. Leonard's attic is at the end of the hallway. His man cave. Does that mean something to you? I tried so hard to forget about that room for years. Oh, what's, anyway, what's that room uh, about? The West Wing is pretty run down after all this time with no windows. Hello? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. You always have an answer to everything. What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I think he knows. He Tell There's something, something more to Irving. What are you hiding from me? I don't think I trust him. I don't understand, Nicole. You know how to turn on the furnace. You know where to find food. Yep. And that the fridge door is busted. Yep. You know my family's story and the hotels. Yep. It's up to FEMA to deliver the supplies to isolated places like the Timberline. I've been up there with the truck every month since I've been on duty. Is something wrong? Dot, dot, dot. I don't know. I, I don't know what you know and what you don't know. Uh, what difference does it make? None. Look at him trying to deflect I, as well. Uh, I'm sorry if I upset you. No one can upset me. I better keep doing the inspection. Yeah, what's, what's my to-do list right now? It's nothing. Okay. We still have that management key, but we don't have any guest room keys, so we're just going to have to rely on doors being open. Staff only? Can I? Nope. Can't use my management key there. I guess. It... Oh, hello. What's that? Hello. Hello. Where is it? Getting close. Is it on the wall? Ah ha ha! Hello. We got there. We got there in time this time. Yeah. Hello? Who is this? Um, tell me who you are? Who the hell are you? Rachel is still there. Don't sell the hotel. What? Is this a joke? Who is this? Don't do anything stupid. Fuck you. What? You think you can call my house and threaten me? Come tell me to my face, asshole. I bet it's Irving. I bet it's Irving. Um, that was a little weird. That was a little weird. Why are they disguising their voice as well? Uh, so while we were running for the phone, did we miss any doors that were open? Who doesn't love a good bottom one? I love the I love the live shows as well. They're fucking great, man. Oh, back to Irving. Uh, I've got a different problem. I don't have time to rehash my past with you. I've got a different problem. Someone just called the hotel. What? Who? Mm, no idea. It, it was a bad connection. W what did they want? They said. Rachel is alive. Don't sell the hotel. <sighs> Idiot. There's something else that doesn't make sense. The phone lines are down. Leonard stopped paying the bill months ago. Mm. I'll ask someone to run a check. They break my balls. <laughs> Unbelievable. I mean, with the storm, the closed roads, and people croaking and all, someone has nothing better to do than bust my balls? Around these parts, time passes in a different way. Some stories seem like they've been forgotten, but actually they just sink down. Sink down? Like tea leaves in a cup. Ook. I think I get it. <laughs> Almost. Oh, okay. Okay, death. not ook. Rachel, I get it now. It I get it now. Painful events, and now it's someone's obsession. You talking about anyone in particular? Well, her death ruined two families that everyone looked up to, yours and Rachel's. Your father, McGrath, the genius astrophysicist, and Rachel's father, the upstanding Reverend Foster, known all over the county. <laughs> Not something easy to forget around here. You know what I think? They can go get fucked, every one of them. I know what we went through. No one else. Fuck them. Yeah, fuck them. Right, to-do list. Nothing. Alright. Oh! 
Fuck you, day three. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, so that so the twenty minutes we were going to spend here has now turned into three days. Uh, Irving is weird. I think we can all agree on that. He he knows he knows too much, and he's definitely there's definitely more than he he's letting on. If he wasn't the guy on the phone disguising his voice, he's definitely related to him somehow. Hey, cutie pie. Daddy. Oh. Uh, Nicole, it's Irving. Oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. It's weird. Um. Were there sleeping pills in the beans? Oh yeah, let's accuse him straight up. Must have been sleeping pills in those beans. Oh, all right, we're not accusing him. I, I am accusing like him though. Literally hibernating. You had a tough day yesterday. I think I had a dream. About? My dad. Leonard, maybe. Okay, I, I need you to pay attention though. Should I worry? The storm brought down some power lines. Oh, there no. are blackouts all over. Oh no. Uh, oh, no. oh, I wonder why that doesn't surprise me. The electricity generator could go bust. We know where the electricity room like is. The idea of you up there on your own in the dark. We need to do something. Right, I'm, I'm heading there. My I'm heading there now. How is slightly limited. Heading there now. It's okay. I can guide you to the emergency generator. If we activate it, you'll be self-sufficient. It's already a little bit, little bit gloomy here. Uh, where's the hitch? Too easy. Where's the hitch? Uh, there are two ways of getting to the circuit breaker. Straight through the garage's side door, or from the floor you're on. Oh, okay. But floor I'm on. The garage side door is stuck. You'll have to pass through the crawl space along the entire building and climb down from your floor. Oh. If the power goes out, you'll be completely in the dark. Oh. All right. What do I All have right, to do? All right, where's the crawl space? Uh, check the closet in your father's apartment and see if he left anything you can use for lighting. Oh, on my way. All right, okay. This sounds like bullshit. Uh, oh, is this the closet? Uh, no, it's toilet. Any poo? Fuck's sake. When are we ever going to see poo? Uh, oh, closet. <gasps> My God, here we are. Look, 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 look. Cameroid super color. Oh, press the this button to equip it. Any news? I found a Polaroid. I got it. Family photo. Anything important? No, I mean a camera. It looks like it works. You want to take a Guys, did anyone ever play the uh, the no. Saw games on Moron. PS3? I was thinking of using so I'm sure that had a bit where lighting. um you had no light and you had to use like a Polaroid sometimes to. Get a little flash. I wonder who this, this one belonged belong to. to. Leonard, maybe? Some client probably left it. You can't imagine what people leave in hotels. Oh, I could tell you about the rubber friend that Mr. Rochford's widow left here so in where's the So where's the crawl space Mayor then? Mayor Linden's kids and I used it as a miniature Indian totem pole for the whole summer. It was a huge scandal. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, yep. Anyway... Polaroid's better than nothing. The light from the flash could come in handy. Could. Right, where's the crawl space, Irving? First floor staff area. All right, where's where's that? Let's look at the map. It's the storage there, and it over from me. I don't know where the staff area is. I don't know where the staff area is, Irving. Um, where's my Polaroid? Ah, it's here. Ready for the big hot one? Got the air comms plugged in, mate. We, we'll be using it tonight. One oh six. See if one of these doors says staff, right? That's what I'm hoping for. Ooh! Aha! Staff only! Alright, let's get in. Crawl space. Any crawl space. Say only. Only. As soon as it gets to double digits, it's so up. So this is. There's no crawl space here. This is. No. Nope. 
to show that map again. Show that map again. Irving said, I must enter the crawl space in the first floor staff area. I'm not even looking at the first floor on the map. Right, so I'm at the overlook right now. I checked that staff area that said storage. So is it a safe bet that anything that says storage is a staff area? So there's another one, another storage bit just opposite the master suite. Another storage area over there next to the museum. That could be a likely one. Let's work our way, let's work our way round, shall we? So first up we'll try the one opposite the, the master. Which is round here, isn't it? No? Can't open it. Okay, never mind then. Never mind. We will we'll go we'll go round. So we haven't even been through here yet. Oh, for fuck's sake, hey. Irving! What now? Okay, almost there. I think the lights are getting. We're worse. going the right way at least. You need to move fast. On the same staff floor quarters? of your apartment, in the staff area, there's a small storeroom. Your father asked us several times to fix the lock. Fingers crossed, it's still broken. That's where the access to the crawl space is. What a professional tone. Ooh. Yeah. Broken. Is it when I want to okay. make a good impression? <laughs> You're the only human being I can interact with while I'm hostage here. Whatever you say will impress me. What happens when I get to the closet? You'll have to go down to the breaker box and switch it on. All right. Doesn't sound like rocket science. Uh, hurry up, please. You suck at reassuring people. It's not a ghost. It's not a ghost. It's a sheet. It's a sheet, guys. Don't don't be scared. All right. So this must be the closet. Oh, I don't like this. Is this the closet? Let's look at the map. Let's look at the map. So we came into a staff area. Staff quarters. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So we've we've been past two lots of stairs, so I think we're in that room next to storage, actually. I think we're in that like R shaped room. I think. Storage. Oh, look, it's even partially open. Oh, flashlight. Yes, please. We'll have that. That would be better. Look at that. How do we use it? Right, we're, we're in. We're making progress. I found the crawl space and also a dynamo flashlight. Know how to use it? I think I just have to push the lever continuously. Is everything okay? Uh, I mean, it's fine. I don't remember it's, the crawl okay space being so narrow when the technicians went inside. Maybe you gained weight. Ooh, it's rude! Oh my up, god! You're not supposed to say that to a woman, to a female. Right, in we go. Come on, push it, Nicole. Yeah, grip it, grip it. Oh, look, I can. I really do have to keep on pushing it. Oh, this is shit, isn't it? Why are we going in the fucking walls now? Oh, now Irving's back. Shit. What's wrong? I am totally in the oh, hello. Hello, what are you? I'd appreciate some help. Cigarettes. Uh, okay. Oh, we Stay can't keep calm. them. Can you see the bundle of cables above your head? Uh, anyway, there should be some cables along the... Uh, yeah, I know what a bundle There's is. cables going okay, both ways, okay. though. Easy does it. All you need to do is follow them, and you'll get to the generator room. Don't go any other way, otherwise... But they go both no ways! Perfect. I got the flashlight, sorta. I got my breadcrumb trail, more like my 
cable trail. Oh, hang on, Whatever. unless we're talking about these red ones. I See, I was looking at these, this All white right. one. Yep. Easy. Does it? All right. All right. All right. I'm following the red cable. Where's my Where's my torch, please? I don't know why we couldn't have just gone down to the garage and gone through that main door. Can I use this switch? No. Right. Kick it. No. Nope. Just going to push it. Push it gently. Push it real gentle. Alright. Tell me exactly which one. Or should I just pull this? Don't need you, Irving. I got it. Uh, nope. Alright, I don't got it. Oh, hello. Lipstick? We're keeping that. I don't know why we're going to need it. Uh, what's up? Uh, hi. I, I want to ask you something. Okay. Uh, go ahead. How long has the hotel been closed? Uh, about four years. Uh, yeah, from '89. I'm sure I mean, so somebody is living in the walls. Somebody's, somebody's the here, for don't sure. Know. Uh, probably pretty rushed. Why? I found something. Another Polaroid. A lipstick. Huh. What's a lipstick doing here? It's, it's Irving's. A lipstick? You don't get it. It looks really old. I remember this brand. The, the girls at school used it. Weird. Weird. What? It didn't dry out. I could even use it it's now. New. It's perfect. It's not even old. I'm afraid I don't get it. Irving. This brand doesn't exist anymore. Oh, okay, it's not it's new. Been, it's not new. I, I don't know, nine or ten years. Strange someone should wait ten years to open a lipstick just to use it, don't you think? Why are you telling me this, Nicole? You want to get pretty there with the generator? Cut the crap. A lipstick here is totally out of place. Yeah, Irving. Nicole. It's just another one of those things customers The customer forget. wouldn't have been in here, uh, you dickhead. I, well, yeah. You're probably right. <gasps> Look, the door just opened on its own. Oh, day four. Day four. We're not, we're not being very productive, are we? We're not getting much done in, in our days here. Oh, I was having a really nice time. I was having a really nice time. <laughs> and then, at Jedi Toker, has decided to be a real dick and make Rusty eat a disgusting bean. All right. Oh, fuck off, am I welcome? Let me... I pause the... We'll pause the game. We'll pause the game. Let's get... Let's get spinning. Let's get spinning. Oh, you're such a bad man. Um... <laughs> We, we have run out of the tropical and curry ones and the watermelon and cabbage ones. So we've got we've got four flavours left here. So let's do a little bit of a spinneroo. A little bit of a spinneroo. That's on strawberry or chilli. Hopefully it will be a strawberry one because the chilli ones are really, really horrible. Really, really horrible. In fact, all of the horrible ones, except the, um, the mouthwash one, are horrible. So let's do... I haven't, even got, I haven't even got Twitch open here, guys. Let's get Twitch open so that I can get to the little prediction thing. We'll do a bit of gambling. It might just be you gambling yourself, Jedi. Um, we're, a bit, we're a bit quiet tonight. We're a bit quiet tonight. Um, ba, ba, ba. Start prediction. Is it going to be good or is it going to be bad? One minute to get your votes in now. Oh, no, Jasmine's here too. There you go, guys. Is it going to be good? Strawberry? Or is it going to be bad? Chili. Let's... Can't tell. Can't tell. I like to smell them anyway, even though they will smell like shit. I haven't got any of my drink left, so I hope it is a good one. The ch it is bad though. It is bad, Jasmine. Um, I've got a tiny, tiny bit of water here. Um, so we'll see. We'll see. Uh, we've got 2k on bad right now. Anyone anyone want to wager against that? Anyone want to wager against that on good? Come on, Jasmine. Get in there. Go all in, guys. Go all in. I know you guys have got points. I know you guys have got points. Let's, let's try and tell. 
Let's try and just let's let's will it. Let's concentrate it and and make it strawberry. That, that's what I want. I want it to be strawberry. I'll be so upset if it's if it's chilly. <laughs> it's very very slowly going up for good, and that looks like time up. Right in it goes. Wish me luck. It is a good one! It's a strawberry one! Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. You got a couple of new clips on Hover to cheer me up? I can't wait to see them. I, I, yeah, I don't need... I don't need cheering up. I don't need cheering up. I'm so happy. That was a good one. Well, let's get that closed down. There you go. Congratulations, Jasmine. Congrat what are you going to do with your wings? What are you going to do with your millions? Um... Yeah, I'll check that out. I'll check it out. I'll, I'll... Is the rock god on there? Is the rock god on there? Mini Rusty loves that clip. Right, what are we looking at? We're reporting. Mm. Reporting is ordered. No, we sir. don't get to. He gets to report you first. Sorta. Of. You forget your coffee? For once, I don't need it. I gotta talk to you about something. Wait, where uh, are we? Okay. Oh, I'm in my dad's office. Here I am. You didn't tell me you knew Leonard. I, I thought we'd been through oh. that. Let me finish. You're gonna spend it on nothing. I spent going through his stuff, and I want to know what you think. About what? You obviously know more about this place than I do. About what went on here, since I left at least. What do you mean, you went through his stuff? What are you looking for? Someone calls me and says Rachel is alive. Then a lipstick appears out of nowhere. It feels like something weird's going on. Rachel is dead. No, I don't know. I don't know what to think. I really don't know what to think. It's just that... <sighs> Look, the storm is dying down. You'll be able to leave soon and go back There's to your life. stuff I can look at when, when Irving can stop talking. forget about the whole thing you did ten years ago. <laughs> what do you care about this old business? It's not worth losing look, sleep look, look. over just to play detective. There's been another call. He had a call as well. I'm not so what, Leonard had moment. a call? I want to follow my instinct. I haven't done it in so long, and it feels like things don't add up here. Okay, let me hear what you're thinking. If there's one thing Leonard taught me, it's that you've got to listen to what's buzzing in your head. First, it might just be a confusing noise, but if you connect the dots, then it starts making sense. And right now, I've got a beehive in my head. All right, let's go hunt some bees then. Yeah, sure, we'll hunt some bees. It's suicide, we have her last words. I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to read this. Um, I think we can read it better if we zoom in. The body of Rachel, daughter of someone, someone, something. Um, she was nine weeks pregnant? <gasps> no. Graphologist Foster Doubts. After 10 years, I saw her at the Timline Hotel. What, 10 years after she died? Mm, it's getting weird. We got more to report? Um, let's go Friend's Story. That's, that's that one on the right, isn't it? In this article from a couple years back, there's a statement by some girl who affirms she saw Rachel in a hallway at the Timberline. Who's this girl? Uh, a classmate, Glenda yeah, Ferguson. Glenda. I tore out the page. She, I think the magazine she's got no was eyes. MT Woman. They blinded her because she knew too much. Magazine. She'd seen too much. They would sell their mother, even their cousins and nephews, just for a bunch of new readers. But she was a classmate. She couldn't have been wrong. Rachel fell 90 feet into a void. She can't be alive. I thought I was the skeptical one here. So, listen to this. Graphologists doubt the authenticity of the oh, suicide right, now we know what a graphologist is. Girl. Who said that? I'm certain of the journalist. handwriting continuous the changes in the style. Do you 
think it's a setup. Forgery or Perhaps. borderline personality. Okay. Well. I'll, I'll hear you out. I found a copy of the local paper, dated December 29th, 1981, the day that the body was discovered. According to the forensics report, Rachel had been dead for days. What's this one? This she is the most mysterious one at all, right here. Uh, yeah, that was the official version. Official version, that's what it says, Irving. Mm. Oh, we've seen that. Alright. Interesting. Interesting. Ooh, look, we've got another puzzle cube. We're not going to do that. How many of these does he need? Uh, what's on our to-do list, anyway? Something's not right. I need to investigate the clues in Lena's room. Oh, we're going to keep on looking. Slander. This is just the beginning. Lousy pedophile. Beware. Shutting yourself into your gross den between mountains will not protect you. You will pay for what you've done. Ooh. Leonard. Naughty boy. Um, we got some weird eye book. What was it psychic navigator harnessing your inner guidance? All right, Leonard. Weirdo. Um, can we can we report now on that little note? No. Yeah, I think you're quite right. It's it's a strong enough word, it can stand on its own. Um, so we've got more stuff to investigate. Apparently, in this room. Occult anatomy. I don't know, Leonard's into some weird shit, man. Esoteric Buddhism. Rituals and techniques for this life and beyond. This thing is, speaking of rituals, what about that candle and that book shit we found in the toilet? Why, 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 is, why, why has that never come up? Why didn't she talk to, to Irving about that? looked at that we've looked at that we've got nothing else to report ah hang on there's desk clues here pastor foster lipstick leonard's book did i did i did i put this shit here because if so i didn't find this right, let's observe it this is rachel's dad this is the dude this is the dude's dad uh, the chick's dad this is rachel's dad lipstick so is this the one I found in the electricity room, or is this another one that's the same? And Leonard's book? Ah, yeah, we did see that. All right. Desk clues. Let's report. Let's see what Irving's got to say. You know, I can't stop thinking about Rachel's father. Reverend Foster. He was a very strict man. Harsh. Even for pastor standards. He and Leonard spent hours debating the nature of reality, the universe, and God. Well, opposites often attract. Do you ever see him? Rarely. He gives a service once in a while. I don't like priests. Priests always made me nervous. Them and their invisible <laughs> boss. <laughs> invisible boss. His daughter's death destroyed his ego. His faith made him even more cynical and lonely than he already was. I can remember him demanding, demanding, demanding total perfection from Rachel. That was insane. You don't think he could have harmed his daughter? Hey, no, no. But even Reverend Foster is a player we shouldn't underestimate in this story. Just saying. Uh, right. Um... I'm Leonard's daughter. Leonard had an affair with Rachel, who was a young girl, which I think is why he got the paedophile note. Um, and then Rachel apparently killed herself, I guess maybe out of shame, guilt, I don't know. So I know her because my dad was fucking her behind my mum's back. This, this is what I think is, is the deal. 
Remember the lipstick I found downstairs? Yep, you made a big deal about it. It doesn't smell. Should it? After they've been open for a while, lipsticks smell really bad. Do they really? I didn't know that. Maybe there's been other women. I mean... No way. From what I gather, Leonard was a sort of recluse. A and don't forget, the lipstick is really old. Um, could the cold have preserved it? Possibly. Clutching at straws, Anything else? Hey, I found a book in Leonard's things. It's a collection of poetry, but it's got notes written in it. Did your father write them? What do they say? Dates, notes, thoughts. Listen to this. Today I saw Rachel. Or Rachel. So maybe she sad. haunts this place. Or Rachel says she feels alone. He kept a diary about her. But the book was printed eight years after Rachel's death. Do you mean that probably wasn't like the most was appropriate redeem, was it? <laughs> Hi, Hannah. How are you, mate? How are you? You're a good egg. There must be an explanation. Well, thank you very much for the host. There's an explanation for everything, and we've got to find it. Okay, I'd say that's enough. Yeah, that's enough for tonight. Uh, today. Is it really? Is that going to be the the end of a whole day? You think there's a lot to dig up in this old story? I think there's loads to dig up. You want to stop me? I'd like to see you fucking try, you Irving. When you come out from under the floorboards town. or wherever you are. You don't need my approval. I don't need his approval. Good job. I'm not looking for his approval. You all right? I'm doing well, all right, thanks very much, mate. I'm doing okay. It's better to leave the skeletons in the closet. Yeah, once they come out, you never know what they'll have to say. It's a risk I already considered. I can handle she it. You handle it. Hard-headed like your father. <laughs> Trust me. At least on this one thing. Go to bed to read the whole day we spent Agent a whole Crawford, day talking to Irving about six advice. things really I'll follow it to the T all right fine let's go to bed on day five I wonder how many days we spend here this is the longest 20 minutes of, of anyone's life I think now into five days Are you loading game? Are you loading game? Oh, a little bit bright. Oh, look, we're, we, this is us. We think we're out here. Hey, cutie pie. How are you? Daddy? Daddy, is that you? Where are you? I can't see you. You came back in the end. It's like the inescapability of a celestial body's revolution. We can't help but follow certain stars. Oh, mate, don't ever, I never have to apologize for being late or not coming or anything like that, mate. Don't even worry about it. Um, is it really you? Is it you? For real? I don't think it is. Are you real? Oh, no, actually, sorry. Yeah, tut tut. Shame on you. And those stars are alive and dead at the same time. I don't understand. What are you trying to say? I don't understand. I, I can't see you, Daddy. Listen, sweet bee. My sweetheart. Listen to my voice. It's important. I can't see you. Where are oh, you? I don't know. I don't like it. Where are you? You know how much I love you. I know, Daddy. I mean, is I've this him? Known it. Is this him? I love you, too. Say it again, please. See if anyone's going to be on. I love you. Well, I'm I'm on every every Thursday, mate, Rachel, until Rachel, I until Rachel, I decide to quit, Rachel, and then Rachel. then I won't be on any Thursdays. That was a whole day, a whole day was walking in the snow, tripping. That <laughs> was what it was. <laughs> Waiting on a phone call from a father dearest. Tell him I say hi. He'll know what that means. He'll know what that means. Uh, all right, better have our morning check in with Irving because morning oh, to do list is still the same. Am I interrupting? interrupting? I was eating steak and potatoes. Oh, I finished eating cake, strawberry shake, and a frothy cappuccino, Italian style. <laughs> so the usual frozen beans. Yes, half a serving. Half a serving. 
You could lose some weight. He did say he, she was getting fat when she tried uh, to get through that crawl space. I did find something. Um, some tapes that were found in the main office. In truth, I shouldn't even have taken oh, them. Irving. <laughs> so what'd you find, Billy the Kid? Well, I, I don't think it's anything useful. Uh, wait, wait, where did I put them? What? The pliers, so I can pry the words out of your mouth. Oh, so you two just sure. need to fuck, all right. Okay, okay. It's, um, it's VHS of the behind the scenes of a TV broadcast, but it's it's all bullshit just to attract an audience. Uh, trust me Jesus, that you can be really long-winded. Yeah, Irving, get to the yeah, point. Yeah, you're right. Sorry. Uh, they're tapes about haunted hotels, weird and mysterious stories, uh, stuff kids like. Uh, with these guys who call themselves ghost hunters. Ghost hunters? Did they hear about the old farting ghost? I'm I forgot about the old sure, farting ghost. But, uh, they went on a tour of old buildings in the county, and they stopped by the timber line, too. Whatever, let me hear it. Okay, uh, but I'm warning you, it's kind of... Well, listen for yourself. Oh, he's going to play it for me. Alright, I'm listening. Okay, okay, the lights look good. How about the headphones? Don't know, there's like a buzzing noise. Listen. Yeah, true. Well, the German ones were better. <clears throat> we are about to enter a nightmare hotel. A place full of deceit and secrecy where terrible lies were played out. Nah, I didn't like that. I'll do it again later. Oh, the room with the fireplace isn't bad. Okay. Spare me the kitchen. I wouldn't know what the hell to say. Fireplace okay? Kitchen? No. Stan, where'd you leave all the gear? Room one. I stuck a piece of tape on the door. I didn't get that. What room? I got a buzz in the headset. Damn microphones. One, one, seven. All right, let's head to one, one, yeah, seven. what's that stuff in camera? It's, it's giving off a glare and burns out the frame. I told you no tricks. What tricks? I didn't use anything. Stop fucking around, Danny. I told you I didn't rig anything. I saw it too. It's uh, a mirror, isn't it? Huh? It looks like the reflection on a mirror. What'd you smoke this morning? What the fuck One, are you oh smoking to? Cut the crap, you freaking me. Holy shit, there it is. There it is. Where? I saw it. It's just up there. It's like a light, like a door that opens. I swear. Get I... It. Stop touching me or you'll give me a heart attack. What are you talking about? I'm like over here. No! Are you kidding? Right, so some ghost hunters have been here. Yep. The tape's damaged. Too damp. But there might be something in 117. I'd say right? Fucking typical. How ladylike. Uh -huh. What happened in the end of the say. TV show? Never aired. Some say they ran off, ditching everything there. Yeah, but they mentioned Look, a room on the. It screws shut. We there was a I'd screwdriver like down in the electric it's, room. Uh, one one seven, I think. I know. I'm already here. One one seven. Yeah. I'm already here, Irving. Same floor as my apartment. This is so stupid. We have to finish the call and then call him back. Hey, I found the room. But. But someone barricaded it with an L bracket. Oh. Fucking L bracket. L bracket wanker. L bracket wanker. Really funny. I need a screwdriver. Yes. I think I saw one. I remember. Don't worry. Uh, I'm I don't going. Where? Probably in the basement. Seems to me I've seen one in the garage. It wasn't the generator room. I'll let you know. Sorry, I'm on it. I'm, I'm going. I'm way ahead of you, game. I mean, it's not the most challenging or puzzling of games. Um. But we're getting there. We're, we're, we're uncovering little bits of this story as we go. And we've already pegged that Irving is, is a wrong un. Hey, uh, found the I'm on my fucking way, no. mate. Give me a minute. I keep thinking about those guys, the, the ghost hunters. You sure it was an act? It sounded so natural. Awesome actors. I'll give them that. I can't stand the idea that my family problems might end up on cable or some tourist guide. Fortunately, it seems that won't happen. They hightailed it out of there. God only knows why. Don't tell me you believe in ghosts or some bullshit like that. Well, I'm not superstitious, but 
If someone believes that a black cat is bad luck, then you also have to believe that something else is good luck. Huh? What are you talking about? Prayer, of course. We have to wait. For me, a black cat crossing the road just means he's on his way somewhere. <laughs> is that your line? Maybe, no, I don't know. But that's the idea. Screwdriver. I'm out of here. I've got it. I, I just need to get off the radio so I can pick it up. Boom. Got it. I bet we have to radio in before we go anywhere. Let's go. We still haven't even found our car keys. Um, we're never leaving this place. Wouldn't it be something, right? Wouldn't it be something if when I take the L bracket off that door, my car keys are just in there? What are these noises I hear? Sounds like chimes or something. Still, at least I'm finding my way around this place now. I sort of I know where things are and I remember, which is a good thing. <laughs> Look at this murderer eyes. Oh my god. see what did they leave in here and who screwed it shut oh, careful don't walk into that just catch your fucking shoulder on it that would hurt that hurt like a bitch um, oh, look, look, look. they left a parabolic microphone need one of them oh look we can have it oh my god oh I don't want to I don't want to equip it What if we hear something? What if we hear something? Let's put it away. Let's put it away. Uh, no, it's still in my hand. Right, let's report everything to Irving. How much do you know about those TV shows? The ones about haunted houses? I know they're popular. A lot of tourism revolves around them. Did the whole Rachel story really bring them here? Everyone in town knew about her suicide. Had a bit of gossip. <sighs> so sad to see the place you grew up in go downhill. I know. I'm so sorry. Believe me. Can we... Can we watch a tape? They must have seen something that spooked them. They must have seen something that spooked them. Aha! Here we go, here we go. Let's see. Let's zoom in, shall we? Have you calmed down yet? Quit playing dumbass jokes! What does that guy do all day? Who, you mean the owner? Leonard the Freak? Uh-huh. I don't know. He's always locked up in the attic. You can hear him pacing up and down. Well, better for us. We've got the whole hotel to do whatever we want. <laughs> Shut up a sec. There's that noise again in the headphones. Sounds like someone is talking. Do you think we'll hear Rachel through that microphone?
She's a little hysterical. Do you think we'll see it on the camera? Yeah, I think like 10 years ago. Oh, the door just slammed. Yeah, I think 10 years ago. Okay. Oh, I just heard a big creak. Right, let's get the... Not that. Let's get the mic out. Anyone in any of these beds? What's my um, what's my current objective? Nothing on my to-do list. What's happening? I wish I knew, mate. I wish I knew. Those ghost hunters were scared shitless. Um, let's see if we can hear any poo in the toilet. Nice comb. <laughs> what a fucking rip off. <laughs> They're not, not even trying. Not even trying. Oh, fuck me. Um, Should we report any of this back to Irving? Oh, man. Those ghost hunting shows. Fuck me. It's like... It's, how can they find... I'm going to find something every single time. No. No, it's... And it's all like, did you hear that? And then they play it back like three or four times. It's like, no, I still didn't. I still didn't. It's just, it's a lot of bollocks. It's a lot of bollocks. I'm not saying ghosts necessarily are bollocks, but a lot of these shows um, absolutely are. Okay, uh, are we done investigating this room? We've got nothing on our to-do list. So, if I walk out the room, maybe Irving will say something. Hey! Huh. For Dickhead! Sake, Irving. Dickhead! Oh, uh, what did I do? He gave me a heart attack. Sorry, I'll warn you with a carrier pigeon next time. Damn. Uh, what? I I'm just curious to know what you found in that oh, room. Oh, you know what I found in that room, you Irving. Be. You're never going to believe it. He's so in on it. Oh, day seven. I'm I'm a little nervous now. We've got this microphone <laughs> that we're going to hear something. Why Why would it give us to, it to us if it had no use and it had no purpose to hear ghostly sounds? Uh, are we we must be in another flashback then. No, because look, that's all still there. Um, so, so what's this about then? Here I am. You still there? Where else should I be? Did you forget what day it is? I wouldn't miss Nicole's amazing adventures. Maybe I put it up then. <laughs> Irving. Don't tell me you're staying on just for me. Go. I promise not to get into any trouble for the rest of the night. I already told you. Maybe. Oh, what do you think? I'm around till you get closure. Dot, dot, dot. I got nothing to say to you, Irving. Yeah, do you like the bear? You always do Like the bear, do homie? Do what? It's a sexy Worry bear. Worry about every desperate stranger uh. that knocks on your uh. door. <laughs> you're no stranger. But I... I don't get yeah, it. I don't get it. You've been a part of this place since you were born. You Irving is fucking weird, man. I, I, I really don't like I him. I'm getting such bad vibes from this behind. guy. Maybe I still have a ways to go. To be free? You're making progress. Two days ago, you would have skinned me alive if I'd called you a country bumpkin. <laughs> what tells you I'm not sharpening my knives this very minute? 
It's good we're just talking on the phone, then. Listen, is this contraption really a phone? It feels like a walkie-talkie slash defibrillator. It's a real phone, and trust me, in a few years, everybody will have one. You think? It's easier for me to believe in ghosts than to imagine people this. being hounded by a phone when they're out and about. I'm... I'm oh, grateful. My medals, not so fucking great. I wouldn't have met you without Trophies. It. Irving, are you hitting on me by any chance? Uh, no. <laughs> what are you... I mean, it's just... I... Relax. I was kidding. <sighs> I can never tell when you're kidding. Men don't get yeah. subtle, ladies. Some of my fascinating virtues. Same. Oh, hold on a sec. Don't go anywhere, okay? Huh? Oh, okay. You have a good night too, Miss Flattery. Merry yeah, Christmas. Merry Christmas, Miss Flattery. Here I am. To be honest, I never thought I'd spend Christmas like this. Do you Sorry, think? I was going off on another flashback about the life of Nicole Wilson. That, that, that'll be it there. Christmas Eve is the right time to reminisce. Think? Yeah. Yeah. I get it too. I didn't yeah. have an Atari. I had a uh, ZX Spectrum 81. In the end. 1K of memory. Like you wouldn't believe it. Kind of and then we had an Amiga 500, uh, which was really cool end. as well. Christmas of 80. Me and my mom were at my aunt's house in Billings, and Leonard was here on his own. While I was it pretending did, yeah. that I liked my aunt's sweater, he and she and your, were... Your games were on cassettes. Nicole. And then the, the they... Amiga had floppy disks. Uh, hey. And a year later, she killed herself. And what she was carrying, too. Don't be like that. There you have it. These are my memories, and, uh... Hey, did you hear that? No. What are you talking about? Like a... I clinking. hear the clinking. Uh... I heard it yesterday, no. too. I, I, I heard it yesterday, hearing... too. Sorry, I want to check. Uh, okay. Right, let's go. That's going to be on my to-do list now, right? Nope, okay. Follow the sound. I've lost it. Maybe it's coming from inside the um, inside the apartment. Yeah. I, I was thinking about earlier when I said I was happy to. Uh, not the you. time, Irving. Uh huh. I, I just I, I was trying to figure out how to tell you. I, I feel real close. I think to maybe it's his end here. then. God, I hear myself talk. I sound like an idiot. That's really sweet, but maybe we should put this conversation on hold. I want to be there to help you. I'm just a useless voice on the mic. Believe me, right now, I would also like a little bit more presence. You know, uh, people get close in lots of ways. Please, shh, a sec. I'm trying to listen to this noise. All right, I get that I might be overdoing it. Sorry, I'm a klutz, and, and sometimes it's... Irving, please, shut up. Thanks. Listen, we'll get this back door's to this, open. But let me figure this, this out. This door's open. Where is this sound coming from? I don't hear anything. Anyway, um, later. <laughs> nice bathtub. Yeah, there was friend. Irving, you hear me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Hey, sorry I didn't answer. I was uh, busy. Oh, uh, no problem. It's fine. What do you want to tell me? This microphone. Sometimes it captures sounds. What sounds? Whispers. 
could be a draft in the crawl space. Oh, I'm not going in the crawl spaces the with this microphone. Yeah, sure. No. It no. Really worry you. Uh, heads up, and if you sense trouble, just let me know. I think we're getting closer. No, <laughs> oh, I had that right in my fucking ear. I had that right in my ear. That was nice. It was just like a man. Hello. I think it was. It sounded like fucking Irving. If I'm honest, he's in here. That's why he was talking over me, trying to listen. Oh, there's a crawl space. The sound is quieter up here. Oh, maybe I go around this way. Maybe up this way. Oh, it's just the wind. I hope it's just the wind. Oh, what if it's coming from up here? Oh, what if it's this? Do you think maybe it's downstairs or something? I don't hear it through the naked ear right now. But I hear it when I use the mic. Let's head downstairs and see what happens. I can't tell if it is getting louder or not if I'm just making it up Just locate where the clinking's coming from. I'm, I am trying. I am trying. Hello. Oh my god, they got arcades? I don't think it's coming from in here. Oh, 
little bit of extra static as I walked up there. Oh, look, it's red. Could this be the way? I don't think it was this picture making the noise. Found anything? I can't hear that sound. I can't hear it. What? It's easy to freak out I when you're understand. on your own. <laughs> Maybe you're right. Who knows? But it seems so similar to how I remember it. Hey, don't think about it anymore. If it comes back, we'll try and figure it out. You know, for a second, it was nice to imagine that the past could come back like that. We always had a party on December 23rd. Maybe you heard about it? It's pretty well known in the county. <laughs> Sounds amazing. You should have seen the ballroom back then. I can almost picture it. The last time Rachel's family was there, Reverend Foster wasn't as sullen as usual. And your parents? My mother had eyes only for Leonard. And he... I saw he wouldn't stop staring at that girl. Rachel. She talked and moved with the grace and confidence of an adult. She wore a dress with a bow on the back. She was so beautiful. Perfect. Fuck. It was the beginning of the end and we were breaking out the champagne. Nikki, I... Sorry, I'm... <laughs> Coming a freaking nostalgic up here. Well, I, I can't hear that sound anymore. It's gone. I'm gonna look around again, and then I'm going to bed. Be careful. Well, well let's see if we can track it down. Is that still our no to-do list is gone now? So did we track the sound down? Was it just coming from this room, and we just didn't find its its source? Oh, day eight. We'll never know. We'll never know, because we've moved on to another day. Well, speaking of another day, I think we should leave the rest of this game, because I think it is quite a short game. I think we should leave the rest of this game for another day. I think uh, we're unravelling a little bit of a mystery here. A little bit of a mystery. Um, but I think the rest we shall save for Tuesday. Um, let's see what's happening here first. Where am I waking up? Oh, in the church for some reason. Oh, <laughs> there we go. And we'll we'll stop it there. We'll save it there. Um, it's been it's been good. I've I've, I've enjoyed this. It it took a bit of a while to get into to to start with, um, but it's been it's been all right. It's been all right. She's a heavy drinker. You know it, man. You know it. Um, let's go say. Hi to Don now. He was in earlier, and right now he's playing Dead Space, which is a fucking great game. Um, so if you've never met Don before, he's a, he's a good egg. He's a good egg. I'll be back and probably finish this game on Tuesday night if you want to join me. Um, otherwise, you'll never know how it ends. I mean, you might actually know how it ends. You can find out elsewhere, I guess. Uh, I'm not going to tell you where to go and what to do, but thanks for coming and hanging out. Um, it's always lovely. Always lovely spending uh, evenings with you guys, whether or not you're here, or I'm with you, or even sometimes you're just in my heart. Some of you are in my balls as well. Um, you, you, sh you know who you are. You know who you are. But I'll see you all next time, friends. See you later. Bye-bye.